How to make melodies that don't suck. Let's get into it. It's funny the difference between Sunday morning and Monday morning. Yesterday morning there wasn't a single person out here when I was filming. And today the whole world is going back and forth in the street. But you guys know what time it is. It's early morning and it's time to go put in the work before the work. I, I fuck. Shit. I suck at mornings. <laughs> me why do i ever since i started making beats for a living that's something i really appreciate about people just fucking rushing the work man I'm, I'm out here fucking going to the gym and making music it just once once you're on the other side and you're living on your own terms you start to really just see how fucking ridiculous it is that people are living their lives doing shit they don't want to do and there's people listening to this going dude i got fucking bills bro what do you mean like i have to go to work nine to five i got a fucking kid i got this i got that and that's fine i've done the same shit there's a lot of people that don't see the other side they don't they don't understand that with the internet now you don't have to do that shit like if you just put in the work and it's just like I just just fucking a bunch of people that are fucking robots and pissed driving through fucking traffic every single day and getting fat and fucking all this shit man welcome to the morning everybody I've woken up a little bit <laughs> you want, do you want to say hi to my vlog <laughs> they say you should ride a wave till the crash, but I don't surf, so I might just fall flat on my ass, but fuck it. <laughs> The lighting is good in here, but at the same time, I feel like it's really harsh. These windows, the sun beaming through here, and then the harsh LED lights, and then down here, it's kind of dark. I don't know, maybe it's just in my head. I've always liked this, like the natural look of a studio, even though I do have the craziest like lights and all that stuff. I think in the future, like wherever I live in the future, I would want the studio to be in like the brightest room in the house almost. So today I wanted to talk about one thing really quickly. Quick tip of the day, help improve your melodies before we get into the rest of this video, whichever that's gonna be. It's been a vlog so far. Say you got four chords, all melodies, a lot of melodies pretty much are summed up in four chords. This is an example of someone whose chords quite aren't there yet. Their melodies are not there yet. And they probably sound bad and they probably sound like this. like wow that is trash <laughs> damn bro that's so garbage like how do I make this better what you're gonna do three note chords that means just three notes on each well it's not the notes what you're gonna do is just get rid of these top notes get rid of the top notes get rid of the top two notes and get rid of the top two notes so you're left with the bottom notes which are the root notes let's let's first play again and see what that sounds like So that sounds horrible. So now, this is where you're gonna have to use your ear. I know, right? You can't just drag in midis, you're gonna have to use your ear. Oh, but Kyle, there's chords in every single midi on earth and you can just fucking drag things in, man. But I know that there's a lot of people that don't make music to, to drag in templates and make them and actually wanna create their own thing from scratch, even if it's maybe not as good as the template thing. I wanna click around these root notes and get something that I like. Sounds good to me. Perfect. I'm going to pitch.
just, I'm gonna shift it up so it's not gonna be in D sharp minor scale anymore. So it's gonna be something else. And then from there, you can just click notes on top. And then from there, you can go to gross beat, preset, half speed, and just smother the whole beautiful melody you just made. <laughs> it's probably gonna sound fire though when I pitch it up. That took me way longer than I actually wanted to make it take. I was getting melodies that sounded good, but it just wasn't the right one for this tutorial. Drop a like if that was helpful. If it wasn't helpful, drop a dislike and let's see who wins the likes or the dislikes. I want to make a beat now and I'm not going to use this melody. I want to use a different melody. then ladies and gents i've been filming for a few hours now um i was kind of getting caught up in this beat i think i'm just trying to do too much uh it reminds me of like drake mi mixed with mixed with black six lakh with a six instead of a b <laughs> fire though hey yeah Yeah, this is one of those beats where I was trying to do the most. It would be something where you'd record some sort of ideas and then kind of finish the beat from there. But I did add like kicks and all that stuff. Maybe I'll play it at the end. Maybe I'll play one of my singles to promote it so you guys can follow me on Spotify. I'm sick and tired of waiting just to find it out. Run it back, it's time to yeah. run it back. Open doors, it feels the same. I drive a 2010 Toyota Corolla. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Oh, wow. Look at this lighting. Look at the sun right in my eyes. Maybe a thumbnail. Maybe a thummy right here. Maybe we'll get a thummy out of this. If you want the drum sounds that I use in all my beats, make sure you check them out. Make sure you catch up kylebeats.com slash kits. I'm working on a new kit right now. A lot of the sounds I've been using are from the Optics kit and the Flex drum kit, Kingdom and Karma. Those are my main kits for drum kits. But yeah, go catch up on those. A lot of exciting stuff on the way. Thank you guys so much for supporting this channel. Until the next one, I'm talking way too much. See you guys in the next video. While I spin. Me, stuck inside the studio, inside, don't hate it, maybe I should get right, maybe you should turn left, maybe you should decide, any tide, pause, instead of getting rocked, close the people you don't like, and don't even know, turning up, walking around, staring at them, oh, that's fun, oh, I drive a 2010 Toyota Corolla, when I get older,